Hi, everybody, and welcome back to the Tuesday Sports Page. We start tonight with basketball. Last week was the 2015 NBA Draft, and with the 45th pick in the second round, the Boston Celtics selected William and Mary guard Marcus Thornton. Thornton is a Prince George's County native and a graduate of McNamara High School. I talked to him about getting drafted and his career from high school to the NBA. It's a real feeling, you know, um, all the hard work, you know, uh, the whole process is really uh, one of a kind, you know, so I'm glad I was able to be in it and, and had some success leading up to the draft and uh, had, had a chance to get my name called. You are from Prince George's County. You went to school here at Bishop McNamara. Just talk about your time here at this school and in the WCAC. I love the school. You know, I really love this area. I love being home. You know, um, every time I come home, I always come up here, you know, play with the guys, work out. Uh, Coach lets us get in the gym still. So um, this, this area is, is just uh, so rich in talent. You know, it's great to come up in this area and play against other good guys and it makes you better you know at the end of the day so um, a lot of guys, I know some a couple other guys from my area got drafted too and it's it's great to see everyone uh, put the time in and come out on top. Coming out of high school you chose to go to William & Mary and the Colonial Athletic Association stayed kind of close to home what was your experience like in college? It was a good one um, great academic school you know I was able to graduate and get my degree uh, very proud of that uh, it was a great program you know be able to uh, really kind of put some things together and have two great seasons to finish off. You know, we kind of got, I got there and uh, uh, we had a pretty bad season. You know, we, we came to, to build, continue to work, and I had a chance to really grow as a player, mature, uh, become a uh, leader, more of a vocal leader. So uh, definitely, you know, pay a, a lot of my success to being at William Mary, you know, being able to uh, use that to kind of springboard me to the NBA. What was it like on draft night 2015? Uh, very calm for me. I didn't watch it. You know, I was kind of by myself. Uh, my parents actually went to the draft, so I kind of had a house to myself, and I was just, you know, watching something different. You know, I just wanted to be relaxed. It's kind of a, uh, it's a stressful long night, you know, knowing I was going to the second round, if I was going to go. And um, but people stayed up late, and I, people, you know, a lot of people uh, reached out to me afterwards, and it was just great to, you know, be a part of that. What was it like when you got the phone call? At what point did the Boston Celtics start to call you on the phone? Uh, my agent actually called me a couple minutes before they uh, made the selection, so I knew just a couple minutes before. And then uh, I guess they kind of let all the excitement die down to call me a little later. And I talked to um, Danny Ainge and uh, Brad Stevens that texted me. So uh, it was just good to hear from them and uh, an exciting night. It's an exciting experience. What are you going to bring to the Boston Celtics? Uh, I think a versatile score. You know, I think I have a natural ability to score, uh, create space, uh, be a playmaker, and uh, use my athleticism you know, to my advantage and my, and my speed. So being able to space the floor, use the pick and roll well, and I uh, continue to work on being a, a good defender using my length and quickness. Obviously going to play in the summer league. Are you looking forward to getting up to Boston and getting started? I am. I am looking forward to, you know, getting with those guys. And, uh, you know, it's, 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 you start over. You know, each level you start over uh, back at the bottom. And uh, you got to enjoy the process and love climbing to the top. Thornton is now in Boston getting ready for summer league play, which begins next week. Special thanks to Matt Walther and the staff at McNamara High School for making that interview happen.